Hello Lilas, welcome back to my channel guys. Today I am here with Emmy. Emmy is the prototype for Jennifer Sussman Price from Silicone Studio. That's siliconestudio.com. And today I'm just showing you guys her, even though she's not fully completed. I just wanted to at least get her shown because her blankets will be available on January 1st on the website. You'll be able to order or I guess she's going to do them in like um, increments between five and ten at a time. And so she's going to load them up on her website and you can go on there and order. Um, and so the first set that will go out will be January 1st. Um, well, that will go on the website, I should say. Um, I'm sure she will have, you know, how long it'll take before shipping time or some may be ready to ship immediately as well. So um, I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of background about my version of the kit. Um, <laughs> so number one, as you can see, I'm in the process of rooting her, so I'm not done there. Um, she is done with her painting. The only thing left that I may do, may or may not do, is tipping of the nails um, because if I keep her in my personal collection I probably won't tip them but if I plan to sell her I will tip them because I like my baby's nails not tipped or very very barely 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 tipped um, but Emmy is a really really good size so she is a perfect newborn she fits newborn very well um I have put her in some older zero to three month clothes and she's fit that fine um in UK brands she fits zero to one month um like I said you know with clothing it's very hard you never know uh, but she's about 19 and a half inches long to maybe 20 inches uh, but she's like 19 and a half inches she's um I forget her head circumference is probably I'm gonna guess about 14 and a half um she has a she has a decent size head um she does take 20 millimeter eyes um, and about the eye thing, I just want to put that out here, full disclosure. And I, you know, I felt really, really bad. This is a prototype, but it was my first time trying to open the eyes completely um, in between opening and sealing them and then didn't like the way it was and resetting and opening and resetting and opening, resetting, duh, 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 back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Um, I didn't do the greatest job on that that process um and so it does kind of change her look a little bit um but the um i will be showing my um any cuddle as well and you guys can see her um the depending on the type of eyes the size of the eyes the color of the eyes um how you set them will change the look of the baby that's it's actually kind of like a plus side to um the the awake babies um well it can be yeah so <laughs> so um yeah so if you see mine and if you go and look and like kathy is painting the process of painting hers and she's sharing hers and her eyes look more like a, a wider set um that is probably more closer to the actual original look um so i do have to you know put that out there first of all um i feel really bad about it actually <laughs> i haven't been able to sleep well i'm like oh my gosh what did i do but anyway um so let me show you guys so my version of her has she has full armatures in her arms in her legs and she also she has 
a little bit of a jelly belly so her her tummy is really soft um these are her feet i actually like her with booties on i don't but these are her her feet so only this toe is separate on that foot and the other ones are not um Decent nail beds for painting purposes. Um, this is her with her legs straight out. Um, because I have armatures in them, of course. I mean, even without armatures, you can you can bend her legs up. Now, I was at the doll show this uh, December and saw an Emmy without armatures. And I will tell you guys, honestly, she can do without no armatures, rather in the arms or in the legs. I feel like she is okay without armatures at all. So if you're a person that don't like armatures, this baby will be okay with that. She's not going to look crazy. In fact, I was tempted to get my next one without armatures in the legs. But I, I love posing so much. And so that... That always make me decide armatures over not having armatures, but I know that I can pose without armatures. I don't know, I just gotten so used to them now. So I'm not sure how I'm going to feel about not having that extra option of posing. Sorry, I'm just making sure her feet, her foot is in the booty correctly. Now it's in there correctly. You can almost feel <laughs> when it's not. But, um, so yeah, so I'm, I'm like, I don't know what I want to do. Um, when I get another one, if I'll get the armatures in the the legs um so now she i am going to take her pacifier out for you guys as well and she does have a tongue a removable tongue but um and jennifer will be um actually sculpting a different tongue she just did that one really quick for me to have one just for play um, but she'll be sculpting another tongue with the other kids, but I, I love my tongue. <laughs> it's probably, I probably won't put it in while she's on camera because you guys will probably think I'm being really rough, but this is like her, her tongue. <laughs> so, it's in this little case. Um, she has a fist here and... She has good um, no beds there, and this hand is open, but these two fingers are together and the other fingers are separate. Um, again, with the armatures, she can do a lot, um, just like, you know, <laughs> with, with these, she can, you know, it is uh, a lot that can be done with armatures. So, with her mouth, I recommend um, a small passy. Um, I, re I recommend a, sm a small size nipple passive, which I do with all my silicone babies, whether their mouth is wide open or not. It just, for me, it just eliminates um, a really tight rubbing or, um, you know, forcing it. And then um, I use um, KY, original KY on the nipple so that it just, you know, ease in better and out. So that's... Um, that's that. Um, I will turn her on her back. I might put the t her tongue in, but I'm gonna 
turn the camera off of her face so you guys don't be like, oh, you're being so rough. So, hold on, guys. I may lose some light here for a second. But I really, I feel like her tongue gives her so much character. Here. I just I, I just love it. I love when she have her tongue in. I am sorry, not sorry. I am just I love, love, love. Wait, let me show you. That's her little her little tongue in her mouth. And I can push it all the way back so it just sits in her mouth like a regular tongue and it doesn't have to be poking out. But Y'all know I like to play. I like to play with my babies and do silly stuff. And it's just, to me, I just like it better. Sticking out gives her more personality. Um, oh, I hate that my alarm keep going off. But, um, okay, I was gonna, that's right, I was gonna show you guys her on her back. And she does fall back. She has a really um, nice neck. I like that it has, she actually have a neck and it's not just a little stick there. It's actually like a sculpted neck. But this is her back. You guys have seen her little bum bum. She has a cute bum. <laughs> Exposing my baby. Um, but yeah, so that's that's her. And she has little cute little wrinkles and it kind of wrinkled as see it's not the wrinkles are not there, but as you move her. The wrinkles come in. She like, uh, let me. <laughs> now you got a piece of lint on your tongue. So, yeah, you'll see a lot of pictures of her with her, with her, uh, with her tongue. But yeah, so she's like I said, she's a good size, um, baby, and really 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 like this one um again like i said um um i'm going to finish rooting her hopefully you know over the next week i'll have her rooted and so i'll be able to show her fully and i will come back i am going to go for now because this alarm is working my nerves um, but yeah, she can take a bottle, she can take a passy, um, the, uh, original blank sculpts has an open mouth, already open. Um, from my understanding, there may be an option of the other blanks coming with eyes already open or the ones that's not open. And don't worry, a lot of the painting artists are very good at opening eyes. Again, this was just my first time. Um, and uh, so this shouldn't be that big of a deal for other artists. Um, and then the blank kits starting price is $1,295 plus shipping. So, um, Yep, and it's soft silicone pour. And I don't know what all options she will have in each kit, but that will be on the website. But I just wanted to give you guys a heads up. Um, I would say that this baby has the most beautiful sculpted body. And she is so cute. I have to say she's definitely in my top three 
favorite um, of the kits that I've had overall. Just out of all the kits I've had, she's in my top three. Or doll, silicone babies, period, full body. She's definitely in my top three. Um, so I will, like I said, make a decision. <laughs> I don't know. I keep going back. I'm like, I'm, I'm gonna. When she's done, I'm gonna sell her. And then, and then I'm like, I go to pick her up or go to get her dressed, and like I'm standing here looking at her now, and I'm like, no, <laughs> she's gonna stay. <laughs> So that's 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 the thing. So let me finish rooting her for those that have been inquiring with me. Let me fi get her finish being rooted and everything and see the final look for her and then I will definitely come back. I will share more of her. If you want to follow more pictures of her, you can see them on my Facebook page on Miss Serenity Smith. You'll also be able to see them on Instagram under Miss Serenity Smith Babies. Um, I will be posting lots of pictures of her um, in the chat about shout out to those members. They have been hanging out, keeping me encouraged throughout the whole process of painting her. Um, you know, I was sharing whips with them and, you know, my ups and downs of, you know, the ins and out of the journey with her. So, um, yeah, I even named her. Guys, if I was a keeper, her name would be Brianna. Like it's it's been a, a process and um a journey. And I just, you know, I don't know. I, I think I'm just I just need to give it some time and figure out what I need to do. It's like I can't hold all the babies. But um and I my goal was to sell her and you know get another one and paint it for myself, but or vice versa, but you know how that go. Anyway, um, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed hearing about Emmy. Again, Emmy is Emmy by Jennifer Sussman Price, and their website is www.siliconestudio.com. I will leave the link in the description box for you guys, and the blank kits will be available January 1st, starting at $1,295 plus shipping. Thank you.